here with Samantha. Samantha and Momo. Momo, nice. And where are you from? I'm from Taiwan. Taiwan and Japan. What is your favorite country and why? So, starting with you, Samantha. Taiwan. I would say Taiwan as well. Taiwan? Okay. I've never been to Taiwan. I think you've been to Taiwan. Um, I grew up in Taiwan. What is it that you love about Taiwan? I like the people and the food is really cheap as well. Uh, I think the food is one big reason why Taiwan is my favorite country. What's your favorite Taiwanese food? Taiwanese beef noodles. Awesome. And uh, what do you love about Taiwan? Why is that your favorite country? Because the people's really nice and also the food's really nice. Nice. Yeah. And it's so pretty. Okay. Yeah. What's a really pretty place that you recommend people should go to or the best place in Taiwan to go to? They should go to Lugang. It's like my hometown. Okay. So I think it's really nice, has a lot of culture, really good food. Nice. What's something about Taiwan that the world doesn't know that you'd like to share? Even though it's really small, but there are things to see and like it's really pretty everywhere, like every single city. It make you want to go to Taiwan. Okay, and you Momo, what's something about Taiwan that the world may not know? In fact, what took you to Taiwan to live there first of all? My dad was working there, so that's why I like grew up there for for my whole life wow. so yeah I'm more familiar with like Taiwanese people like and Japanese. my culture than Japanese okay. people yeah okay it is it's very welcoming and it's very diverse of like any types of like any anyone so I think okay. that's one reason why Taiwan is do you speak Taiwanese I speak Mandarin, Mandarin. so yeah is that, is that what they speak in Taiwan they speak Mandarin and Taiwanese okay. yeah okay cool nice. she speaks she speaks Taiwanese. I speak Taiwanese all right nice all right so then let's go to my next question what's a word or phrase that's really cool to know in Taiwanese because Taiwanese doesn't have like you can't write it down okay so like everything's really different okay Li Ho what does Li Ho mean it's like hi hi yeah I think that's a bit more interesting than hi okay how would you say let's hang out I think I'm going to to Wow, that was long. Slow, slow it down for us. Ligame tsuki chito. Ligame? Tsuki. Tsuki? Chito. Chito. Ligame tsuki tiko. Chigo. Okay. And you? How about... This was fun. This was fun. Can I say it in Japanese? Yeah, tanoshikatta desu. I know, I, know, I know Japanese. You can't tell me Japanese. I know Japanese already. Alright. No. In, 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 well, not Taiwanese. In, um, what did you say you spoke? Mandarin. Mandarin, yeah. Wait, what is it? Like, this was very fun. This was fun. It's like a Oh yeah, this is a good I can't repeat that for anything. One more time. This is a good Okay, this is a good one. That means <laughs> this was fun. Alright. Who is your favorite celebrity from Taiwan? JJ. JJ? Who's JJ? Ling Junjie. He's a very famous singer. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Cool. And yours? Do I have any... Wait, let me think. Alright, from Japan then. I really like Yuasobi. Yuasobi? Yeah. Who's that? It's like a duo. Like a... Producer and singer duo. Cool. Yeah. What brings you both to the UK? I should have asked that first. Uh, it's my first time here, and I'm here for summer school at UCL. Nice. Yeah. UCL is not too far. Like I studied at SOAS, the next door. What are you studying in the summer school? Business psychology. Yeah. Also for the same reason. Business yeah. psychology. Awesome. Uh, I'm, I'm studying data science. Data science. Yeah. Nice. Fantastic. Well, thank you, and enjoy the rest of your trip and time here. Thank you. I'm here with Eine, Luisa, Ari Londa. Hey, where are you all from? Germany. Yeah. Germany. Germany. How do you all know each other? Um, university. So what did you study? Law. Law. All law. We are law. Law students. Law students. Hmm. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> all right. So, what is your favorite country and what? Mine's Turkey. Australia. Albania. Albania. Oh, that's a good mix. I love this. Okay. <laughs> Let's start with Albania. Why Albania? Because my parents are from oh, okay. from Kosovo, but they're Albanian. What's something that the world doesn't know about Albania that you really think is interesting the world should know? I think it's a very friendly country for vacations also. It's very beautiful. People think that it's criminal, it's dirty, but it's actually not. It's Of course, we had war. We had bad presidents and everything but it's a very beautiful country and a nice feeling of home. Where would you recommend people go to in Albania? South of Albania, the beaches and of course Rogova, it's in Kosovo. Okay. It's your mountains and everything, nature, very beautiful. Fantastic, awesome. And Australia you said, let's see, why, why Australia? I've been there, it was very beautiful, yeah. I love it. They have a great like work-life balance yeah. and yeah, I love it, it's like, sunny out there and they have great beaches and the people are just relaxed, like I love that. How long were you in Australia? Uh, you in? For a month. I just went there because I wanted to do an exchange here uh, like a few years ago but it was cancelled because of Covid. Okay. So now I went there to see it anyway. Like, yeah. And I think you're the second person who said Turkey today, so why Turkey? Because my parents are from Turkey uh, okay. and I love the countryside there. You love the countryside? Yeah. Any particular area in the countryside that you'd recommend? Izmir, but I would like to visit Cappadocia. Okay. And what is a slang in Turkish that is interesting to know for the world? I don't speak 
Turkish okay. very well. Okay. My German is better. So. Okay, in German, what's the slang in German? Sexish. 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 That sounds like sexy, but it's not, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. Germany is divided into 16 states, yeah, exactly. right? And every state, a state has its particular dialect okay. or accent, yeah. you would say. Yeah. And that sounds really funny. I can't imitate it though. So is Zexic a place, or one of the no, it's states? Like a language, it's like a dialect. Oh, it's a dialect. Yeah. Oh, okay. But it's so funny, so you can't take anybody serious to speak yeah. stuff. Okay, please, can one of you give me some words in Zexic? No, I can't. Can you do it? Words in Zexic? No, no, no. I have no idea. All right. Zexic people, they're letting you down. Okay. <laughs> All right, for Australia, what was the interesting slang? I don't know any slang from Australia, but okay. no. But I know a fact like that the animals there are not as dangerous as they seem. So really? They're not in the cities. They're not so in the cities, okay. Yeah, so okay, yeah, I think it's in the outback, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, they make it seem if you go to Australia, every single animal is going to try to kill you. Yeah. But I guess not in the city. And yourself? I don't know. Albanian I think slang. it's... Uh, Albanian slang? No, no. The dialects are good everywhere but yeah. I think it's nor North Macedonia uh, it's the most funny dialect okay what a slang word I don't know from Albania who is a celebrity or public figure that you really like I think it noisy it's my favorite sing singer I know he has nice music yeah, <laughs> from yeah. Australia is yeah. Margot Robbie Margot Robbie yeah, 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 yeah I love cool. her yeah, she's, she's a, gorgeous she's a great actress yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. and I loved her in Barbie okay. <laughs> um, it says an Axel it's my dad's favorite singer from John. Turkey Turkey's. yeah I all love right. her very much great fantastic thank you all Chirin Chirin nice to meet you so what is your favorite country in the world? Senegal. Senegal? Okay, yeah. that's a good one. Why Senegal? Because it's my uh, country. Okay. Yes. What's something that people don't know about Senegal that's an interesting fact that you think you could share with the world? We have the best food in the world. Okay. What's one of the things that you think is best in terms of food? Chepujen. What's that? Yeah. Uh, a rice with a sauce. And sauce? And it's, not, uh, it's not like jollof rice, is it? It's same. It's like that. Okay. Yes. Okay. If you could describe Senegal in what word, in one word, what would it be? Amazing. Amazing. Yes. Awesome. Fantastic. Who's your favorite celebrity or public figure from Senegal? Sadio Mane. Sadio Mane. Yeah, he's an amazing football player. I don't know about the best, but he's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, uh, it's a great. Player. He's good. I don't know about best. I don't know. I'm a CR7 kind of person, but I give it to Sadio. He's really good. If you could bring one thing from your country, from Senegal, to any country you're living in, what would it be? The sun. The sun? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we do love our sunshine. What's the most surprising thing that you've learned or know about Senegal? The kindness of people. The kindness of Senegalese yeah. people? Okay, that's nice. Do you have an example of a particular situation where somebody was really kind to you in Senegal? I'm loving my translators. Thank you so much. <laughs> Everybody's smiling. Yeah, okay. everyone's okay. smiling. Okay. He's very smart. He's very kind. Okay. Uh, all of people. Okay. And uh, for the all of people in the world. Okay. So I know Senegal is, is a French-speaking country, right? Yeah. Okay, so you speak French. Or is there any other language that you speak from French? Senegal. Kanja, Kolof, and uh, Pul. Wow, okay, those are a lot of languages. Okay, yeah. so choosing just one, what's a interesting slang, phrase, or word you'd like to share with the world? Nangadef, Nangadef. Nangadef, what's that? It's a hello, bonjour. In which language? Wolof. Wolof, okay, one more time. Uh, Nangadef. Nangadef, all right, thank you. Uh, me, I, uh, I say Nangadef, and you, you say me, Mangifi. Okay. <laughs> Is it Magnifique? Yeah. Okay. So. Nangadef. Magnifique. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. That was amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah. Your name? Lisa. Lisa and. Maria. Maria. Nice. And how do you two know each other? Uh, she's my mom. Your mom. Okay. Nice. <laughs> Which is your favorite country in the world and why? Italy. And? Portugal. So why is Italy your favorite country in the world? The food, the vibes, the architecture. Everything. It's just, it feels like home there for me. Nice. Yeah. You spent a lot of time in Italy? I've been there most of my childhood. Oh. Every winter I went there skiing and things like that, yeah. I didn't know Italy was a place to ski. Where do you go skiing in Italy? Santa Maria. Santa Maria, yeah. okay. Yeah. And you said Portugal. Why is Portugal your favorite? Food and men. <laughs> <laughs> the men, okay. Portuguese men. You have a, a fan here. From those respective countries, if you know any, what's an interesting fact? that you think the world doesn't know about those countries? The world doesn't know that the king of Portugal, his wife was killed and when he became a king, he asked to take her out from the... Coffee? Yes. Yeah. He put her on the throne and asked all the officers to give to kiss her. No way. Yes. How long has she been dead after he asked for that? Years. That's foul and weird. Sorry, moving along. What's a phrase or word that you really like from either Italy or Portugal? Um, I know songs. Pierto Soltano, Volam Yo Canto, Messaggero d'Amor. What does that mean? 
That means something about love. Okay, okay. And you from Portugal? <laughs> <laughs> she knows Portuguese. Yes, I like everything what sounds good in Portuguese. Okay. <laughs> Eu gosto do coração. What does that mean? I love your heart. Okay. Yeah. I like your heart as well. You guys are really friendly. Thank you. Who is your favorite celebrity from Italy or Portugal? My celebrity is my daughter. Your daughter. <laughs> and, and your husband. She has a Portuguese husband. You have a Portuguese husband? Yes. Okay. okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Enjoy the rest of your trip. Okay. okay, I'm here with Miranda. Nice to meet you, Miranda. And where are you from? From London. From London. Okay, great. A lot of people are in London today, actually, so that's really good. How long have you lived in London or UK? I've lived here for about 36 years. Okay. Yeah. Where were you there before? In Botswana. Botswana, nice. So you're Botswanan. Born and raised. Do you go back from time to time? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Well, my last time was 2017, yeah. so I'm due a trip. Awesome. What is your favorite country and why? Obviously, Botswana. Yes! <laughs> I wanted you to say a different country. Yes, Botswana. No offense to the UK. But yeah, all right. What, what, what is it about Botswana that makes it your favorite? Well, it's just beautiful. It's natural beauty. If you want safaris, it's got the best safaris in the world. We are kind and gentle and we are safe and people will welcome you. We just got a lovely country. Fantastic. It's beautiful. I'm getting all of those vibes from you already. So yeah, <laughs> thank you. Describe Botswana in one word. Stunning. Wow, stunning. I haven't heard that today. Stunning. That's an amazing word. Stunning. Nah, that's nice. So what's one place that you'd recommend that is stunning for people to go to in Botswana? One place I think everybody should go to is the Okavango Delta because oh. Botswana is quite dry and then you've got this wonderful waterway up up in the north and you go to a city which is called Maun. There you can go on a lovely little canoe boat which is called a Makoro. It's just amazing. You can be in the water and elephants just to your left and hippos to your right. It's stunning. You have sold that to me. I've got to put you Botswana to on my list. That sounds amazing. And it's just one best safari country this year. Wow. Yeah. In the world? Yeah. According to who? Oh, I'd have to look it up. But I th it was one of the big yeah. Conesta or whatever. Who is your favorite or one of your favorite celebrities or public figures from Botswana? So there's a runner. The British will call him Tobogo. He is a, I think he's a 400 meter runner. Brilliant. Ooh, who's my favorite? I'm only thinking about my friends really okay. <laughs> who are brilliant there. Okay. Most people wouldn't have heard of anybody but we ha we did have a Miss World okay. some years, that? oh okay. my goodness it was some years ago. Okay. And then what's something about Botswana that you'd like the world to know about that the world doesn't know that's of interest? People probably don't know that our biggest imports are diamonds and beef. Botswana beef is the best in the world. Yeah. I meant export. export. Okay so your biggest yeah. exports are diamonds and beef. Oh wow. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What's your favorite food or dish from Botswana? Pap. P-A-P. Okay. Yeah. What is this, like cassava or something? It, or? It, it, it's very similar. It's maize meal. Okay. Yeah. It's, okay. So I think other places would call it inshima, and it's just maize meal, ground maize meal that you put. Yeah. So what do you have it with? Meat and vegetables. Okay. Sounds good. Share one word or phrase, I guess, from the Botswana language. I'm sure there are many, but whichever one you speak or know that you think is interesting and the world should know. Oh, they're all rude. <laughs> that's, that's what we want. Maybe. No, I can't. I'll just say Dumela. Dumela. What does that mean? That just means hello. Dumela. People are so boring. I just want to say the boring ones. Ah, oh, the swear words are always the fun one. Oh. If you could bring one thing from Botswana to London, what would it be? Year-round sunshine. Oh, you're telling me. <laughs> you're telling me. Lots of people have been saying that. The weather here is just. Don't be fooled by what you're seeing right now. Yeah. yeah. Year-round yeah. sunshine would be nice. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much. You were fantastic. Thank you. Hey, where are you? Kareem. Kareem. And Kareem, what do you do? You said that your TikTok and stuff is popping. Let me know. No, I'm like travel influencer. Okay. Yeah. Don't. Go. What's the best place you travel to? England, man. Good. All right. Nice. Nice. Where you from? All right then. Where you from? All right. All right. All right. All right. In it. In it. In it. Let's go, bro. Let's go, bro. Let's do it. Mandem. Yeah. Yeah. Mandem from the ends. Yes. All right. Yes. Cool. It. Yeah. Nice. Oh. Yeah. All right. So the question for today is: what's New your York. New, New York. York. Yeah, bro. Uh, okay. <laughs> what's your favorite country and why? New York City. New York City. Okay. I've been to New York. I think it's pretty dope. But why do you think it's the best place or country in the world? Um, it's a place, concrete jungle where dreams are made of. You're quoting Alicia Keys now. I'm not <laughs> quoting Alicia Keys, I'm quoting myself. All right, all right, all right. It's a concrete, it's a concrete jungle where dreams are made of. I don't remember the rest of it. <laughs> so you are quoting Alicia Keys? No, I don't remember, I don't remember the rest of my own club. All right, what's your favorite thing or favorite place in New York? My favorite place in New York? Yeah. Shut the f up! My favorite place in the New York? The bank. The bank? The yeah. Fed? Yeah, the oh. Fed, bruh. Okay, okay, Let's fair go. enough. Let's get a pop. Uh, what's some New York... Let's get a pop in. All right. Oh. <laughs> what's some New York slang that something like the world should know? What's some, like a key New York slang? What's good? What's good? What's good? 
<laughs> What's good is what? used everywhere. They love it like that's your, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, just your, yeah, your, yeah. Y e e e e y e e e e e e e r r r r r r. Your, yeah, yeah. Okay. It means hello. It means hello. Yeah. I've never heard anyone say that in my life. Your, your, your. Your. Okay. Now I'm gonna go to. Are you guys? Are you all from New York? It means hello, right? Yeah. All right. So you told me that. I can, you can help me get my, my Instagram popping. How do I do that? What's Venmo me 150 bucks. What happens after I Venmo you 150 bucks? I run away and delete my account. <laughs> Fair enough. So what do you do? You do well, what's your... I'm a comedian. I feel like you can't give me a straight answer. It's funny. Are you I'm actually a comedian? Yes. Oh, my bad. Okay, I can't tell. I'm I can't a comedian. Tell. I can't tell. I'm a comedian. Oh, okay, 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 okay. What's something about New York that you think would surprise people to know? That everyone's actually really nice. Really? Yes. But they're not trying to scam you and get money from you because the typical culture in New York is crazy. No, bro, we're not talking about Istanbul. We're talking about New York City. No one's trying to scam you in New York City. Come, come, come. come. I've been, I've been a couple of times. I do like it. Did you, get, right. did you get scammed? No, I didn't get scammed, but the typical culture is crazy. Were you scared? Well, no, I wasn't scared. Tips I'm, are the biggest scam. Yeah, yeah. Tips are the biggest scam, right? Yeah. yeah. But you have to tip 20. You have to. You have to 20? To 20%. Oh, 20%. Okay, that's Unless terrible. they do a bad job, then you can tip 15, okay. which sucks. That sucks, right? It does suck. Because if they don't do a good job, you're still tipping them. That's I've been leaving mad tips here. Yeah? Yeah. People don't do tips here. Oh, they must what's, what's be been the know me. What's been the reaction when you've given tips here in the UK? Nothing. Nothing? No yeah. one said anything? No one said thank you? Ungrateful Commonwealth. What's one phrase you would use to describe New York? Amazing. 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 I've heard that a few times today. What, what makes it amazing? It's just the best place. It's the great, it's the center of the universe. There's nowhere, there's nowhere like it. All right. It's the only place to live. You should move there. I I'll, I'll come there and I'll do a video in New York with you guys. If, if, you can if, yeah, 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 let's happen. If you want to get popping, you got to move to New York. Yeah, all right, cool. Thank you, bro. I appreciate it. Easy. Yeah, I'm here with B. Great, nice to meet you, B. So what is your favorite country or place in the world? So what's yours? Uh, I would say Africa is my favorite place in the world. All right, why, why Africa? The nature, the food, the people, the vibes, yeah. Okay. Africa, yeah. Is there a particular part or region of Africa that you really like? And if so, why? Uh, nah, Africa and Europe, uh, yeah. and Jamaica too. The I want to go to all of these places, but yeah, yeah. nah, no particular reason. All right, so from Africa, what's a slang or word that you really like? Maybe oi, because oh, yeah. I hear that. Yeah, that's yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. So I think it, it means oi. Yeah, yeah, come here, come yeah. on, let's go. Yeah, nice. All right. So, what's something about Africa? An interesting fact about Africa that you think people don't know? How resourceful it is. I think people know already, but I don't think. Us as Africans, we appreciate that much sometimes. Uh, how is also Africa is so, yeah. Oh, nice. That's what and then, if there was one thing from Africa you could bring to whichever country you live in, what would it be? I would say the culture, the respect, respecting older people and things like that. You know. Yeah, that's a big part of many African cultures. That kind of thing about respecting the elders. Sometimes it can maybe go a bit too far, yeah. but yeah, 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 you know, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. So everyone respect everyone, respect See, the but culture. Knows. And, my man yeah. knows. All right, thank you so much. Have a good one. Peace.